Well, hello YouTube and welcome back to Retired for Life. So, it's beginning to look a lot like spring around here. Oh, I have had the uh, snowblower off of the back of the tractor for a few weeks now. I've only actually used it seriously, maybe twice, and then just played with it a couple of times after that. But they are talking about the chance of snow tonight. So, so they say there is some snow coming. So that means I'm going to go ahead and uh, take the grader blade off the back of the tractor as I was using that for scraping slush and that kind of thing. Uh, and I'm going to go ahead and put the snow blower back on as I would rather have it on and not need it than have it not on and need it. <laughs> so we're going to take a few minutes, do that, get the grader blade out of the way and get this back on. All right, folks, we got our snowblower back on. I'm gonna go get the grease gun and uh, get everything all greased up. Now, now you won't see me doing how-to videos on this kind of thing, like hooking up the snowblower and that kind of stuff. I don't consider myself an expert on that. There are videos out there that will show you how to do it, hopefully safely. So if you're looking for something like that, look up something specific for that but because I don't consider myself truly knowledgeable with that because I just haven't done it that many times I'm not going to show it to you guys and possibly teach you the wrong way to do things so do the same thing I do look it up refer to your manual always refer to your manual all right folks we are all set chain is oiled. I use wintertime chainsaw bar oil for that. All the grease fittings are done. But there is one that I want to show you uh, that you might not be aware of. Now, I don't know whether all tractors have this, but this has got the uh, infamous treadle pedal that a lot of people complain about. Now, I'm just, I'm used to it. It doesn't bother me. But sometimes this pedal will get stiff and underneath this flap is a grease fitting so you got to remember to get that as well because if you don't grease that eventually your treadle pedal is going to act up all right we're just about ready 
to put the tractor away now and we'll see what comes. Well, there's one thing I almost forgot about. The shoes on this thing are all the way up, which means the scraper blade on the bottom here is going to be running very close to the gravel. And I don't want that. Because I don't want this thing to turn into a bulldozer and be, and be uh, throwing all my gravel out. So we've got no base left. So that'll be the last job here. We'll get these shoes set all the way back down. Just in case. I don't believe we're going to get the snow, but we'll see what happens. Well, it's the next morning. No big snowfall. So we'll get out to the shop, do a little bit of work there. I got some cleaning up to do. And then we'll see what tomorrow brings. Well, this is it, folks. We got the um, big storm last night, and we got maybe four inches of snow. Probably not quite that much. Uh, looking at the forecast now, they're talking about rain again in a few days, so this isn't going to last very long. So there's not really much here, but with the rain coming, I'll probably uh, do a cleanup of it anyway, and do a, you know I got to shovel the walks and that kind of stuff. But let's have a quick look around with the drone and see how things uh, generally look out here. Takeoff. Home point updated. So, as you can see, there's a little dusting, a little teeny bit coming down right now, but that's, that's pretty much it. Is winter over? I know the groundhog saw his shadow or something like that or didn't see it, which means uh, winter is ending earlier, according to the big fat groundhog. <laughs> but um, a little bit disappointed in that. I was hoping for a bit more uh, winter fun, but Huh? What are you going to do? It's okay. We'll get out uh, and working on the trail that much sooner. So let's uh, bring the drone home and I think 
that is going to be it. So I guess that's our weather report. Uh, we'll get things put away, get the uh, tractor out. I got the snow blower on it, so I might as well use it for something. Uh, I know at the very least I'm gonna need to clear the end of the driveway. So I think that's going to be it for today's video, folks. I hope you found it interesting or at the very least entertaining. And if you did, please don't forget to give it a like and share. And I'd love to have you subscribe to the channel. So remember to stay safe out there, be good to each other, and we'll see you out on the trails the next time. Is that it? Is winter over? It's not even the middle of February. Stupid groundhog.